From Soldiers Radio and Television, this is the Army Today, a daily feature from around the globe. Soldiers of the 427th Field Artillery Regiment are sending rounds downrange. These 2nd Heavy Brigade Combat Team soldiers are conducting a live fire exercise as part of the Network Integration Evaluation, or NIE 12.2, a semi-annual capabilities assessment of new military technology. The heavy metal batteries are firing 155 millimeter shells from the M777 Howitzer and the M109 Paladin, using live ammunition to keep the training as realistic as possible. I always have to say proficient at your MOS. You can train all you want in the motor pool, dry fire, but it's not real training unless you actually get to do your job, shoot live out in the field environment. As part of the NIE, Ford Observers and Fire Control are evaluating new communications equipment that integrates with the Warfighter Information Network Tactical, or WIN-T Increment 2, a high-speed satellite communications network that accelerates operations and improves mission performance. It's been very beneficial, but now that we've got the flow of information the way, going the way we want it to go, like I said earlier, it's allowing us to talk faster, get that airspace cleared so it can shoot faster, get accurate and uh, timely rounds on target when the maneuver unit needs it. Feedback like that will be provided to senior Army leadership at the end of the NIE to assist in the decision on acquiring the new technology. Soldiers must continue to train throughout their time in the Army, and the inclusion of new equipment during the NIE gives them even more of an opportunity to learn. But as heavy metal soldiers experience the tests, there's just no substitute for the real thing. Army Sergeant Brian Spradlin, 16th MPAD, Fort Bliss, Texas. That's the Army Today from Soldiers Radio and Television.